the defense. Good, well spotted there by the referees and the delegate before they got the game underway. That would have been an unfortunate way to start the game. Uh, one too many players, but we are underway here in Match of the Week. It's Chris O'Reilly here with you live in the Pick Arena. The lovely uh, brand new Pick Arena it is Kielce to get us underway. Uh, as expected, Shimon Sichko starting in the left back position, the number nine, Igor Karacic in the centre back position. And Nedim Remili gets the nod ahead of Alex Dishabayev at right back. That has happened often enough this season, both of them equally brilliant and will get a fair amount of time on court. Morito, the only right wing in the squad today, comes in as a second line player, stays out there in fact. Ball into the line, nicely played. Bit of backcourt playmaking by Marie. Nicola Torna. Quick response, uh, not much Andy Wolf could do about that. He got a touch in that, but Ricard, they were going to make it a contest midway through the second half before Kelsa stepped up a gear and came away with the victory. As they've done on all but one occasion this season so far. This season, 28 goals to his name. Mario Shostaric today as well with Sanchez Mege on in the line. That's good defending, and in the end, the referees give the ball to Kelsa anyway. Away goes Arcadius Morito on the break, and there's a simple enough finish for him. Bombach, Bodo, oh, nice movement from the big man, Ricard Bodo. Milovic, Milovic steps out to three, three and a half meters. He goes low, shot goes high, 4-2 Gielsa. Gielsa here, pretty close to the head, that one. Milovic dropped down, shot right through the arms, no real danger of... Both severely tested today. Oh, it's a beautiful pass inside, and the finish is just... A Maybe we won't. 5-2 up, it's another one. Tonneson save, rebound opportunity. And Dylan Nahi, he's going to go the long way round on the break. He better score it, and he does. Sick the shot a little bit. Timeout taken by Seged. Let's hear what Pastor has to say. And the penalty. That's oh, nicely put away. Seb Fremel. So the nerves a little bit. <laughs> right through the Bombach. Tunison lays it into him. Bombach in the right hand side again. Tunison goes one against one. Sanchez Mega on there. Oh, it's a great pass inside. Ben Savanhidi. He's feeling a bit confident now. Whips that pass out to the left hand side. Bodo has space. Into the line. Banhidi saved by Wolf and away go Kielsa. Then the left hand side. Arcadius Morito. Oh, week in, week out, mind you. An incredible, intimate atmosphere. But here in the 8,000 capacity, they're not filling it completely every time as we see a brilliant goal down the left-hand side there on Bombach. Just playing with Remili, just leaves a beat, little shove, and Andy Varina, the new project. And from a neutral perspective, really hope to see the team deliver. That side, great steal by Bombach. And away comes Shostaric on the break into the bottom right-hand corner. Back within two again, that's a great steal, great hustle from Darren Bombach. Not what you always expect to see from him. His first of the day down the right-hand side. It's at 8-6. Oh, that's a great pass again! Uh, Nikola Tornav. Now he blind pass across. Mashkovshek just out of his reach to these teams and see what they're made of. Sichko. To Remili, Remili from far out this time, he puts it in. Keeper strats immediately, that's what happened though. Down to the far post, Remili cut across in the last second. Ball inside, it's a great pass by Tennyson. And Puto gets into attack there. Would have come off if he didn't. Attacking player who started the game, will take this penalty. He dispatches it, and kills it. Step it up a gear. Number 10, the Portuguese international in on the left-hand side. And an immediate payoff there. Good blocking there by Banhidi. Rasterson to Danny, hand up for pass and play again. Rasterson goes through alone. Oh, really well worked there. Looked like he was running into a cul-de-sac. Really nicely done there. See it again. Uses Garcia and Dia. Well, not exactly neither of them a goal. And Seged still four down as we have now went through the final ten minutes of this first half. Yeah, Derny in as a second line player, creating a bit of space. Out to Martins on the left hand side. Miguel Martins, what can he come up with here? Lays it off down the right. Garcia and Dia, that's much better. 
drawing the defender's attention. Nice movement across the line as well. That created the spit in possession. Four goals down, looking to come back into this contest before the halfway mark. Uh, that'll help. Nice move down the left-hand side. It'll one two. Receives that ball inside. Two in a row from Miguel Martins. And that gets a second. Their brothers, their teammates go through that. They're going to have to find a way to regroup. Ilyevich in these one-on-one -on -one battles and a chance on the right-hand side. Garcia Dia into the top left-hand corner. Strong on the line. It just hasn't worked out for Artsem Karlak after Dia. Bombac. Oh, finds a way through all alone. Dia Bombac. For Gielsen, give them the lead once more. Morito against Alilovic. Oh, it's a solid, solid penalty. These are fast breaks. Not a great shot, though. One from three from the penalty line for Seged. And there is a and away. Come Kjeltz on the break with Dylan Nahe. Three goal lead. Look, the far better team here for the next 30 minutes to come away with the victory. On paper, weaker opposition. They've yet to really pick up a notable victory so far in this season's EHF Champions League. That's a great ball behind the back of Nicola Torna. But the referees don't mind it this time. Bombach goes through low this time. Rockets them. Left and right backs, you can fill in. There's one of them, Dushabayev, laying it off. Ball inside. Oh, it's a brilliant finish. Brilliant performance so far. Bombac looks to go through alone again. One man show here in the attack. Bombac now, basketball saw goes down to center, looks to break through alone. Three in a row for him, and it's going to be the old one. Do whatever he could, not allow him to shoot there. But he's got their number at the fence, and six on six here. Lots well, good movement, really good movement down the left hand side. Bodo. Lays it into Banhidi, uh, simple as that. He comes out. It's a ball in. Defense of Banhidi, oh. Well. Having words in the backcourt there. Morito looking to get involved. Hand is already up for passive play. Gracic. Really driving this attack now. Wouldn't be surprised to see Miguel Martins come in. That's a great pass inside, though. So, Ricard Bodo showing he still has what a lap here, oh, stolen. Arcadius Morito with a brilliant steal, has all the time in the world on the break. And Arcadius Morito but nicely picks his spot. And he could have had a goal moments before that. Instead, Morito say play on. You have to regroup here. Ball at the Blons. Well put away, Alexander Blons with his opening goal of the day. Of angle, but he's got a great jump from the left wing. Now when he's needed, Karacic again, and the right-hand side, and at the near post, Nedim Remili makes it. Doesn't matter what's gone before, as long as you're putting them away now. Remili, going the long way around, looking for Nahi, finds Nahi. Nahi with no angle. Oh. Rito, in the transition, defense, ball out to the left-hand side to Nahi, slipped through the legs of the Polish wing. And his teammate on the other wing. Finish the move. Day for him. Bombac. Is it out to Martins? That's much better, Miguel Martins. The home side. Really nice. Through the opens up a bit of space for Bombac. He scored in this position in the first half. Not this time yet. Martins. Oh, that's good. There by Dushabayev. Marito's on the break. Lays it off to Nai. Oh, gorgeous finish. An inch of space to Manidi. And Marito unselfishly lays again. Here comes Marito. This time he will go all alone into an empty net to shoot. Arcadius Marito. He's come in and really had Banhidi rolled. Two minutes suspension. Alexander Blontz with the penalty. Blontz puts it away. Second half. So many two minute suspensions. They haven't really been punished to the full extent though. Shabayev goes alone. Oh, versus Blonts. 
Two rising stars, left wing, this is the keeper. Blunts, oh, a scorcher of a penalty from Alexander. And penalties don't come much better than that. Absolutely gorgeous. Keeper goes low, fire that one. And Morito steps up once more, Morito puts it away once more. Martins. Oh, it's a great pass across. Garcia Dia. To force the issue a little bit in the first half. In the second half, has had to be patient as Bombat Yushabayev lays it off to Morito. Yushabayev gets it back again. He's got a bit of space here. Ball into Karalek and Artem Karalek. Former Seged coach. Bombach. Oh, he's all through alone. Uh, well put away. Assuming don't, things don't turn around here. Lose a game this season, that'll be a tough test for them. Alborg uh, looking to find a bit of form. Nice ball across. Dushabayev to Dushabayev. And uh, Danny Dushabayev to Martins. Still playing 7v6 here, but just not looking very incisive. And Martins, as soon as I say that, there would result in a penalty. Not this time. Ball into Gaber. That's a sweet little lob over the keeper's head. Feels like they're controlling enough, and it feels also a bit like. Second, aren't really. Shot has to come in right now. Ball out to the left wing. Gita, shot over the keeper's head. This one might not be the better side overall. Bobats. Into Gaber. Save by Wolf. And one last chance. Shot into the empty net. It's Womza Industria. Another home defeat for them. They are 